Today, uh, got my son a power wheels that we found in the garbage. Went on Amazon and found this neat little adapter. So I could put a 20 volt DeWalt battery in it. I know most of you dads out there, moms too, you're gonna have power tools, so what kind of motorhead doesn't get their kids in the vehicle, so. My son's got quite the collection over here, right bud? What do you got? You got four wheeler, truck, Jeep, side by side. Now he's gonna have a fast four wheeler. Not sure how long it's gonna last, but it'll be fun while it does. Stay tuned. It's gonna be pretty quick and easy. Let's see if I can set the camera right here. There we go. So first, we're gonna start out cutting this old plug off. Toss that out of the way. We've got our auto strippers, or whatever you wanna call them. Strip these wires back. My help didn't stay too long. It's already out there playing. Bless you, bud. You having fun? Just wait, bud. We're gonna make this one fast. Fast? Yeah. The other toy. Then we're gonna strip off the wires on this adapter. They are poking out me. Am I toes? What I'm gonna do. Oops. Stop. Stop. Oh no! <laughs> what I'm gonna do is use these spade connectors. Crimp these on real quick. What I like to do is put a male end on one wire, female end on the other wire. That way you can't mix them up. Kind of idiot proof. I, uh, back on. I know they're not color coded, but it's okay. They're only gonna plug in one way. Bentley, don't touch the camera, bud. I unplug it. Don't touch. I gotta clip it. Red wire goes to red, black goes to black. Get this wire in, yep. Don't touch. Take our wires, plug them in. Grab a little bit of electrical tape so we can cover up the bare metal. So I wanted to use the connectors that way when this four wheeler does burn up or whatever, I don't really know how long it's gonna last or how good it actually is, but I don't want to be, or I don't want to have to keep on cutting the wire shorter on that. So come over here and grab our drill battery real quick. Good old DeWalt. Set the 
that down in there. Get some of your stuff out of the way. Bentley. Come here. Hop on. Wait, wait. <laughs> That's in low. Here, now try. Hold it. Hold the gas. Hold the gas. That's only low gear that he's in right now. Moves pretty good. Bentley, put it in high gear. Huh? Put it in high gear. High, high gear. There you go. I guess this is a good time if anybody's wondering what all the background noise normally is in my videos. We have a little farm here. We got some ringneck pheasants. We got goats in the pen over there. We got some chickens. Turkeys. And a little boy that's stuck. Ready? Go. Probably figure out something to do with traction because uh didn't last as long as I hoped but Bentley still had a lot of fun on it I got both batteries on the charger right now we'll see uh, after they're fully charged how long it lasts but I don't remember last time I charged both batteries so probably last a lot longer but she scoots when she's or when I first put the batteries in but the issue I'm having is in low gear both tires want to go in high gear only the one tire wants to go and all it does is spin so we're going to try to figure out a way that we can add traction to it if we get maybe a, a mountain bike tire and do a strip down the center and uh, something like that I'm going to do a little bit of research online and maybe we'll build this up a little bit that way he can have something have fun on but keep you updated thanks for watching like comment subscribe hey Bentley Go. She scoots.
just had the battery on the charger for a little while, but. Cruise was pretty good. Is that your four wheeler, Bentley? Yeah. Is it fast? Yeah. Can Daddy ride it? No. Please? No. Let me ride it. There. Huh? Volt drill battery. <laughs> Try again. Yep. Show them how fast it is with you on it. I think I'm probably in trouble when he gets gas. Started making this video about two weeks ago. So, or a couple days before Father's Day is when I originally put this together, but the only other modification we did was, this is a 20 inch uh, bicycle tire. I cut it and then every two inches or so I put a self, self tapper, which I gave it these humps or whatever, which is actually really good for it. And I didn't cut off the slack, I just overlapped it, which doesn't seem to be an issue. It actually gets really good traction. It almost acts like a paddle tire with how far these actually stick up. Kind of see. Gone through quite a few batteries on it. It doesn't seem like it's having any issues with anything wearing out or anything. My son really loves it. Probably faster than all of his other ones. Except for that one. We kind of upgraded him to gas. I might make another video on that, but this is pretty cheap, reliable fun so far. So. Thanks for watching. If you made it this far, like, comment, subscribe.